Ready, set, go. Hey, good morning, guys. I would be moving around. Oh, did I startle you? I'm so sorry. I would be up moving around, but I'm kind of tethered right now, as you can see. I restored my phone last night, but for some reason it just didn't feel right, so I restored it again, and, and it downloaded a lot of things a lot quicker. Um, I just didn't put my music and my movies back on there, so I'm kind of bound to the cable right now. <laughs> so I'm in the process of just putting the music and movies and all my fun stuff back on there, so that's what we've been doing today. Uh, Alec has just been relaxing, taking it easy. Um, it's been an interesting morning food-wise with him. He hasn't been really wanting to eat except for snacks and stuff. Yeah, you got your Lego book, huh? I know he loves his Lego books that come in the mail. They're amazing. But he's just been wanting a snack. But you know what? Honestly, grains, crackers, anything that has a lot of just starch to it, I'm okay with it because that's going to help his tummy feel better. And he's just going to feel better. And this is still throwing me off. I don't know why. I don't know. I guess when you're attached to them, it'd be like me shaving my head. I've done that, and it was almost like a mood change. It was so weird. But it is it's good to be home. I was just thinking this morning, it is so nice to be home, to get up in your own bed, take a shower. But it's sad. I do, I do miss Disney. I miss Disney a lot. It's kind of sickening how bad I miss Disney. I don't, I don't know why. It's just, I do. I love it. I love everything about it. It's just, I could sit, I could go to downtown Disney and just ride the buses around all day and ride the monorail around all day, and I would be so content. Yeah, that's what you did, huh? Did you go on the monorail? Mm -hmm. Did you have fun? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you did. Were you, were you up high? No. Oh, did you say hi? You waved to people, didn't you? Mm -hmm. No, you didn't go up that high. Mm -hmm. No, okay, yeah, he didn't go up that high, just for the record. But yeah, we'll see what happens. I would love to move closer to Orlando. Oh, to have a season pass again would be a dream. I would, I would die to have a season pass again. So. But I gotta go to work today. Alec gets to hang out with Mimi. Oh, and oh, and Mama, Mama and Mimi. So it's gonna be a good day for him. They're gonna stay the night there. I'm gonna come home, vacuum, and just kind of clean up the house. So when they come home tomorrow, they're they're gonna have a nice place to kind of relax and just take it easy. So, but this weather hasn't been too bad. Um, it's been kind of it's been kind of quiet. So it's been just rainy and just kind of dreary and stuff but it's okay hopefully huh no mama well and mama <laughs> so he, he doesn't want mama to come i guess it's just mimi so but he has to get there somewhere or another but, but like i said the weather has just been okay i'm hoping for a sunny day i miss that heat i miss that humidity yeah. it was so nice yeah and you get to ride in mimi's rum yeah you do come here come say hi just for a second just for a second Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. <laughs> Can you just say hi? Look right here, come here. Alec, come on. Can you just say hi? Can you blow him a kiss at least? Uh, hey, take that and run with it. Take that and run with it, so. But I'm just going to let him be and let him just be a fussy butt. So I don't know if any of you guys follow soccer. Um, but last night I got to watch Orlando FC, a really favorite team of mine right now. Um, I haven't been really been able to get into Major League Soccer that much, but um, one of my good co-workers talked to me about it, and he said Orlando's making a really good team, and I looked at their roster and I saw Kaka. Now, I'm a big fan of, like, from 2005, 2006, 2007, that Brazilian team. Well, and he was one of the members of the Brazilian team, and he used to play for... I believe AC Milan and um, Real Madrid, I believe. So he's a pretty well-known player, and he's playing for them. So I got to watch the game last night, and it was amazing, amazing. I haven't really been able to get much into Major League Soccer in the United States. Um, so I watch a lot of English soccer through the Barca's Premier League. I've watched a lot of Spanish through La Liga, some of the Italian leagues and stuff. So, But not too much in the United States, but this guy's... Oh, they've really got me back into it, and it's really awesome. So if you guys haven't checked them out, uh, check out Orlando FC. Um, and also maybe catch a Major League Soccer game. They're, they're up and coming. You know, I'm really impressed with the quality and just, I mean, just the game is getting a lot better in the United States. So it's going to be nice. But this morning I woke up and I put this on. I'm like, oh, that color almost feels like that that purple, the purple lion that they have. And I'm like, oh, I love one of those jerseys. It would be so nice. Good morning, you guys. 
Do you want to know what I'm having for whatever this meal is? I guess it's lunch. I'm making ramen. And you know why? Because now I can say it. I'm pregnant, and that's what sounds good. So, I did this without putting any thought into it whatsoever. Okay. I think. Um, so yeah, now I can actually say it. And I'm really sorry that I look like such a mess this morning. I kind of just got up and she went to work and I put Alex down for his nap in a little while later than that. And it was just kind of like, why? My hair is a mess. Um, <clears throat> so it's weird to be able to say that to you guys now because for so long we weren't able to say anything or we didn't want to say anything. We could have said stuff before, but we just felt like it was, you know, probably good to wait a little while. Um, plus then some other stuff happened and that's kind of what made us realize that we wanted to say something and I'll, I mean, I know that's big, um, on my channel that, okay, so if you go to our Daily K Vlogs channel, like main channel, there's the other channels option or button. You can go there to see a link to my channel. It's just called Christian Packa. It's just my name. Um, and I'm going to have weekly updates on that channel. So um, I think in the next few days I'll have the first batch of them up because I've been doing updates every week since we found out. Um, so I'll just go ahead and make those public instead of private like they are right now. And then, um, so that'll give you kind of like a little bit of a backstory, you know, you get to kind of catch up. Um, but yeah, so then I'll talk some more about this past week, what happened. And, um, but that's pretty much it. So this morning I'm just making some ramen for lunch. And then we are going to head to my mom's house after Alec wakes up from his nap. We're going to spend the night at my mom's house and then I work tomorrow. So, um... It's going to be a good weekend, I think. I never make ramen on the stove. I always do it uh, in the microwave, and then it never turns out well. So Tyler's always like, you need to make it on the stove. I guess I'm just impatient. So today, I'm making it on the stove. You'll be very happy. How are you guys doing? You enjoying some nice weather? I hope so. Ours is really nasty. It's still raining. And it's still really cold. I don't know exactly how cold it is, but it is pretty chilly. You want to know what the best part about eating ramen is? You can eat it in your Cheshire Cat mug. See the inside? I love this mug. I'm a mugaholic. Look at this. Like, I don't know if you guys have seen that before. But yeah, I have way too many mugs. So okay, this is almost done. So I'm just going to put you away for a little bit. And I will talk to you later. Okay, so, you know that whole thing where I was like, he's not sleeping, and I wish he would sleep, and whatever, well now he's asleep. I'm taking a shower, I've done my makeup, I'm in bed now, and super comfy by the way. And, oh, also, I'm eating jelly beans. These are the Starburst, the Sour Starburst jelly beans. I don't never eat jelly beans like during the rest of the year. Occasionally, I like to get the tutti frutti jelly belly ones just because they're my favorites. But, like, I never ever eat jelly beans any other time of the year but around Easter. So, I was really excited to see them at Target. Um, I haven't had the Cadbury eggs yet, the chocolate Cadbury eggs yet, and so that's probably on my list of things to get in the coming weeks. But,. Yeah, I'm just kind of sitting here catching up on some vlogs from our trip. Um, we really didn't have any downtime <laughs> during our trip, so I didn't get any time to watch vlogs. So now I've caught up on Daily Bumps, I've caught up on Ellie and Jared, I've caught up on... I'm catching up on Zoella. I've caught up on Randy and Anna. So anyway, so I, I have to catch up on Tribe Tyler too. And CTFXE. And a few others. <laughs> the list is very long and I do not have that much time. So um, I'm hoping at some point Alec is going to wake up so we can go to my mom's house. Um, but he can sleep as long as he needs to sleep because hopefully he feels better. I'm just hoping he's not as grouchy and 
he's in a better mood to go see my mom. So, um, but yeah, that's been pretty much it. Just kind of hanging out at the house. It is cold outside. It's like in the fifties and it's raining and cloudy and just, blah. so I think we all miss Florida a little bit because it is hot there and sunny. And I know we would actually miss the, this weather if we were there. So the grass is always greener, but, um, for the moment we miss the warm sunny weather. So that is pretty much what's going on right now. Not a whole lot to report, just chili beans in bed. Sounds pretty good, huh? Mmm, Alec! Oh, it seems like so much more. Ooh! I'm telling you, they shrank. It seems like so many more. Yum. Can you make the turkey? Hey guys, oh, it is so nice to be off work. Oh, there is no greater feeling, I must say. I mean, it was a great day, don't get me wrong. It was always good to be back at work, to get back into the groove, but it just feels so good when you're off. It's so nice, I love it, I love it. Now I'm headed off to the grocery store. I'm gonna get some groceries tonight. Um, Kay and Alec, I'm sure, as you probably saw and heard, they are at Mimi's, so they are relaxing, having a good night over there. I'm kind of sad I don't get to say, see Kay two nights in a row, because she's at her mom's tonight, and then tomorrow night she goes back to work, so I'm kind of sad. But, you know, I figured I'd maximize this time, get the house kind of somewhat cleaned. Um, I'll vacuum tomorrow morning before I go to work, so just kind of take advantage of the downtime while I have it. So, But I hope everybody's having a great day. What have you guys been up to this weekend? Hopefully it's been fun. Um, this weather hasn't been the greatest, but um, it's been nice. I can't complain. I'd much rather have it lightly sprinkling than just pouring down rain and thundering. So I will take this here over anything. So, but, but yeah, been a good day. Been a good day. Um, you know, I'm excited. I, it's weird. I always, I always think about what's coming up next and what we got going on. And I was, I was talking to some coworkers and stuff at work today about, um, you know, if you could drive, if you could go anywhere within like a 48 hour vacation and you drove four hours, where would you go? And I got some really cool, re I got some really cool ideas and stuff. So I was thinking because we're going to have a couple months between now and VidCon and usually we'll do something with her mom and we'll see family and stuff like that. But I was thinking, you know, what would be some really fun things that we could do? Um, Isle of the Palm, South Carolina came up. Um, the holiday or Christmas park in Indiana came up, which is an interesting one. I've never heard of that. It's like a Christmas land theme park. I thought that was kind of cool. Um, but yeah, there's just a lot of a lot of cool things that are coming up. So if you guys have any ideas or any cool places um, within about a four hour drive from Knoxville, um, let us know. Uh, maybe add them to the comments. Let us know where would you go? What are some places you know you would like to see if you could go and or if you are in this area, where would you like to go? What would you like to see? Just to kind of maybe see what's available to us. So, but ugh, it's trying to get in and out of this grocery store. Hey you guys, so I'm actually in bed at my mom's house. Sorry, I'm so quiet. But Alex is sleeping and my mom is sleeping. So I have to be quiet because I should be sleeping. But I'm not. I'm editing and recording and eating. Because my tummy's upset. So that's what we're doing. I think we're going to go have some fun tomorrow. Can I go visit my grandma? And I have to work, but that's good because I get to see all the people that I've missed from work, so that's exciting. But I hope you enjoyed the vlog. I hope you have a good day, or have had a good day, or something. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Just go ahead and click subscribe. You know you want to. Why are you hesitating?